further to add. Your Honor, I swear to you, I am innocent. Innocent. That will do. But sir... I said that will do. As I was saying, it has been proven beyond a shadow of a doubt that Jean Paul, being the tavern keeper, did purposely and with malicious intent allow one of his patrons to become intoxicated with ale. The defendant did not effectively warn the plaintiff that the plaintiff could, under the influence of the defendant's ale, act recklessly and without thought to personal injury. But you will know. That will be enough. I find the tavern keeper's actions unconscionable. I find the defendant guilty as charged. John Paul, keeper of the tavern of you, I sentence you to prison to await your fate. Death by fire. No, he can't be. Now ready to hear the next case. Who brings this case into court? I proclaim that I, the Sagamon, do bring forth this case. Very well. Who stands accused, and what are the charges? I hereby accuse the pirate wench known as Raven of the willful and wanton destruction of the gargoyle race. To state specifically, that she knowingly and intentionally brought down the glorious dome that protected the city of Ambrosia to drown the inhabitants of the proud gargoyle city. And to further state that to ensure the death of the gargoyle race, Raven did then kill the gargoyle queen, thus making the reproduction of gargoyles um, impossible. To what? To state the most heinous crime. To ensure the destruction of future generations of gargoyles, this raven did destroy the egg nest. To state that raven is guilty of all of these crimes, and of the destruction of a proud race. Defendant, you are charged with the crime of genocide, the willful destruction of an entire race. How do you plead? Wait a minute, Your Honor. I have something to say. Silence! I will not tolerate such outbursts in my court. Now, how does the defendant plead? Does it really matter how I plead? The defendant will respect this court and enter her plea, or she will be harshly punished. Fine. Let's get this over with. I plead guilty. No. Your Honor, she didn't do any of those things. I did them. I told you to be quiet. She's obviously guilty. She just said that she is. One more word from you, and you will be held in contempt. The punishment for which is death at the stake. Now be quiet. Raven, this court finds you guilty of the crime of genocide. You are to be burned at the stake until you are dead. You are to be transported to the prison wrong immediately until such time as your sentence is carried out. Do you have any final words? Yeah. Piss on your justice. Very well. You've made it easy on this court to order your death. Bailiff, 
Take her away. Did you not understand me when I said that I would hold you in contempt? I mean it. I don't want to hear another word from you. Use her, she wasn't even there. To see the Avatar, do you think that he wishes to join my people as they sleep forever? It was their own fault, as I can explain. To explain? To once have been a friend, but now to lie to me and tell me gargoyles killed themselves. Do not listen to lies. You have to let me prove that what I say is true. To not be smart, but to have been taught by Visagraland to listen to others, and to not make judgments. To be fair even to you, Avatar, the one who killed my people. Very well. To give Avatar the chance to prove himself. Handy. Your true enemy isn't me, but the columns that invaded Britannia. It affected your humble people and twisted their minds causing their pride to take over their common sense. Through no fault of their own, the dome was beginning to collapse, but the column made them refuse to see the signs. When Wislam's sculpture of the queen was activated, it added to the instability and cracked the dome, flooding the city. To lie, to know that you wanted gargoyles dead, and to see that you killed them, to know that without a queen, gargoyles now do. I'm sorry that I could not save your city. But I have brought something that can save your people. As I left the city, I took a queen's egg from her chamber, that another queen might be born, and the gargoyle race can continue. No. To be possible. To think Avatar tells truth. To see the egg, and to know that now we have new queen. Oh. To know my people died because of pride. So you understand that Raven is innocent? To see truth. To see that wrong has been done. And to no, talk to the right To tell him what happened. To know he is smart. And will know what to do. What do you want me to do with the egg? To go and activate the lift. So you may take egg to the Sagrilet. To show the Sagrilet that all is not lost. You just teleport away. that one. Because it had a door that opened, that wouldn't open. Which would make sense if it belonged to somebody who could fly. <sighs> yeah, all the 
provision. Do you need provision? Yes. It's most gratifying that the trial was a fair one. Our citizens must be able to rely on the fact that they can get a fair shake in this world. Do you need provisions? No. It's most gratifying. I can't sell. You have finally fulfilled my people's prophecy, Avatar. To think that you must wish to die. To think you are a fool who come before me. The Sagralim, please. Do not die yet, though. To know you should live to see your loved ones suffer. To be in agony. To see in my mind the faces of those who died. To know such pain. To know that you killed them, Avatar. To know that you killed the gargoyle race. To know that they will not be forgotten. I'm tiring of these false accusations. To say to me that you are innocent? To be disgusted by your lies? To know you have won over Desbit? But to remind you that Desbit is stupid? To know that you cannot fool me as you did him? Vesagralim, please. I have brought you a queen egg. To see the queen's egg. To remember Desmond spoke of an egg. But to not have understood. To see that he was right. You have saved a gargoyle queen. But to be confused. To see that you vanquished my people. But saved one egg. I am sorry for your race. But pride was the culprit. But Sagrila, If I had really wanted to destroy your people. Would I have brought you a queen's egg? To admit that you make sense. To now begin to understand what Desbit was trying to tell me. And to be devastated. To know that pride destroyed my people. To regret that I could not prevent this calamity. To owe you an apology, Avatar. To have believed you guilty. And to have knowingly blamed your companion in an attempt to repay you for destroying my people. To have been so wrong. How to prove that I am sorry. Do you know the mantra of justice? Do not know the mantra, but to advise that you consult the book of justice that is housed in the library. Do you know where I might find the sigil of justice? To know that the sigil is known as the quill of justice. To know that the book of justice holds the location of the quill. Have you learned anything about the lenses needed to view the codex? To have found the red lens after much searching. To happily provide it and thanks for all that you have done. To hope that it serves you well. To be 
being sadly responsible for your friend's plight in the prison, to now wish to help you save her, to meet me in Wong, by following the northern trail east across the bridge, to show you the secret entrance to the prison. Thank you. I will meet you there. East across the bridge. That's actually Stone Gate overlooking you, or you overlooking Lord British's castle. Sounds. Guess it out of choice. Oh, 
interesting why they draw that. Potions. <sighs> What's going on? Fucking bow's missing now. This is dungeon. <laughs> See him now. That's wrong now, a fucking building. That's just wrong. To find entrance to prison underwater. To advise you to cleanse the justice shrine before returning to you. To do so is the only hope for justice in the land. To let you rest assured that I will plead your case before the judge. But you know that you must cleanse the shrine first. I'll do that. Thanks for letting me know. <laughs> to meet me at the Court of Justice when you are done. 